Hey guys, it's Frankie, Simply Imaginary People, and this is just a short tutorial on how to use Skinnator because somebody asked how to get skin into game. So this is what Skinnator looks like if you open it. In the top, I uh, just write in the name of the skin you want. Here you've got basic non-default, default replacement, or advanced non-default. Uh, I usually work with the basic non-default, advanced non-default just means that uh, teens can have a different skin to adults, while basic non-default means that the teens will use the young adult face and adult body. So I would only use advanced non-default if you've literally for every age and every sex decided to do a different skin. Default replacement is default replacement. So we're going to start at the beginning, we're just going to write in our name. You can use the game tone ramps if you like, like green, red, blue. I hate these and they always look, make it look crap, so not. Um, you can make your own tone ramp, so tone ramps look like this. Literally, you just use the gradient tool, but I've got tutorials separately on this, so I'm not going to show you how, but you can use the gradient tool, set uh, two colours, maybe white to some kind of brown, and drag down, and you can see you can create your own tone ramp. Maybe I'm drag down to there or something. Yeah, so that makes your own tone ramp, and you the tone ramp is in size. 256 times 256 and you're just going to import that tone ramp. So where's my stuff saved? Yeah. Nope. Projects skins tone ramp. Okay, so you interpret tone ramp here and then you import your thumbnail here. Thumbnails look like this. Again like here, top to bottom, top to bottom is left to right. Also 256 times 256, just this time you save it as a PNG, while this is saved as a DDS. Again, open your PNG folder, uh, your PNG, and you'll see it's flip flips direction. You can add multiple tone ramps if you like. Uh, I usually don't because it's just a waste of space. Right, then you go to the age. So you've got baby here, usually ignore that. Toddler, uh, child, teen, young adult, adult, elder. So mine is um, for adults, so I'm going to go to young adult, and it'll say male here, and it'll say face specular. So if you make your own specular map, you can import that. If not, then um, if you go to Skidinator, wherever you installed it, you'll see that you'll have specular normal app skins. So I can go to specular and find the one that says AM face. So I can use that one instead. But I didn't make my own. Um, face dot base. If you want to do it properly, then theoretically you should make a dark and a light version of your face. Um, so that when you go towards the dark part of the tone ramp, your face does not lose detail. Otherwise, it'll be like a colour overlay to make it darker and it'll lose detail. If you're making a skin like me for a specific uh, character who you know is going to be the colour of the skin you've made, don't bother. So here I'm just going to say face dark base. I'm going to use my skin and face light base. I'm going to use the same skin. Face normal again either I can do um, make sure you're under male here and female and you're on the wrong one. Uh, I can just use the one from skin later if I haven't made my own. So specular normal, normal and sign the one that says AM face. Here we go. Right, this is only the face stuff. Now we go to adult and just going to do the same thing. So I'm just going to, while I have this open, find the one that says AM body. AM face P, face U, AM P, AM scalp, AM face, AM body. That's the body normal. Face normal again, AM face. Scalp normal again. Want to find it? AM scalp. Not doing anything female because I didn't make a female counterpart to the skin. If you did, obviously that. Then specular. Uh, we'll just quickly do this one. For elder as well while I'm at it. EF face. Do that one or the AF face. I usually use the same one because I don't really play elders, but I like to put the skin tone in. Right, face specular again, specular, 
in face. Body specular, A and body, face specular, A and face, scalp specular, A and scalp. Now, half the time I don't use these, so I don't actually use scalp speculars because I find them really pointless, or scalp normals because unless you did something to edit them, they're pretty much blank. The others you can use if you want to, you can test it out if you like them. I don't use the overlay or the body muscle overlay, I just let the game use its original. Um, so for body dark, again, if you've made a dark version of it, then import that. If you haven't, import the light one in both body dark and body light. Same for face, import light, import that, and same for scalp. Scalp light, scalp dark. Right, then you've imported everything. Still got the elder one to do. I usually do it for all ages straight away, for teen, young, and adult elder, if I'm making an adult skin, just because. Uh, go to tone settings, here you go, matte less shine, glossy more shine. I usually kill this down and ignore this, but again, you can wet or plastic shine. You can fiddle around with these settings, I usually just do this. I don't know if it makes much difference. When you've done all that, you've imported everything, just say File, Compact, Save As. Do not press Save As. If you press Save As, you can see that for we imported the same face texture for young adult, both ages, teen, not, but that's twice the same texture. And then the face has got it here as well, so that's 3, 4, 5, 6. So we've imported the same face image six times. If I press File, Save As, it's going to save that image six times. It's going to be a massive file. If I press Compact, Save As, it's going to save that image once and link it for the other ones, which means it's going to be a lot smaller. So compact save as. And then just save it as wherever you want. Cast skin simply deal. And that is pretty much all you need to know about skin nature. Make sure you don't import the wrong specular into the wrong normal or normal into specular or something or your face into normal because it'll look really weird in game. If you're unsure you can always press view to see what you've done or and then delete and re-import the correct one. That was it. Hope that helps.